Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays with more Link to the Past. We're back home temporarily. I actually did a little bit of configuring because we are going to be doing the seventh Dark World dungeon today. And in order to do that, we're going to need to get out our tutti flute. Because we're hold holding up. I don't know why I said that. We're going to Lake Hylia. That is warp spot number eight. Pardon my inability to speak the language I first learned. All right. So we're going to try to get into the dungeon itself. Sans injury. I need you to quit. All right. So first things first, hop into the water. Go for a dip. We're going to head back into the main part of Lake Hylia. Do people say Hylia? That seems wrong. Because they're Hylians. So like, I don't know. Anyway, no, whoa. Okay. So first things first, now that we have the Titan's Mitt, we can lift this rock up, and this will give us the portal to the Dark World that we need to do for the dungeon today. And it's as simple as that. So this dungeon's really, really easy to get to. Um... You can do this in either order, this or Misery Mire, whether you want to do this as six and that one as seven or vice versa. But here we are. This is the Ice Palace. If you couldn't have figured that out yourself. Oop. This guy looks nasty. Well, good thing that we have the old Fire Rod. You're going to want to make sure you have a good amount of magics in this one today. You can thank me later. D Mike, the magic flames will protect you inside this icy dungeon. Thank you. Very cool. We're going to be careful with this one today. I um, I did take it upon myself to do a little preparation. I did preparations A through F, and now I'm on to preparation H. To be safe in this dungeon. We actually do have a bit of a benefit today that you'll see eventually. Um, because we did the Misery Mire first... We actually can skip a decent part of this dungeon, so we're going to probably do that just for funsies. You know me, always wanting to do everything 100%. Just kidding, not true. Oh boy. I don't like to look at this at all. You know what that calls for? Oh yeah, it's time. Uh, taking unnecessary damage is what I was going for, not using the Bombos medallion. But hopefully you're all doing well. Hopefully you're all enjoying yourselves. In the US and day, it's almost the best holiday of the summer. The 4th of July happens on the 4th every year. Very cool. Hoping to enjoy some Independence Day festivities. Let's actually see. I haven't looked at a dungeon map in a while. I keep forgetting to do it. Nope. Nope. How do we do the map? Uh, this? Viewers, I did it. Okay. So we're on the basement. This dungeon has, oh my goodness, seven floors. That's a lot. Well, of course, we will be doing all of them today. Well, I mean, well, you know, probably shouldn't say that because I don't know that for sure. But it's very handy to have the Bombos Medallion, especially when you have... What? Oh, I did Ether instead. Oops. My bad. I didn't know it did that. Huh. Well, that freezes enemies, apparently. Now you know. I guess I got kind of enamored with Bombos being pretty OP. I wasn't even thinking about the other varieties, but that's okay. Who need Quake and who need uh, Ether when Bombos do trick? Okay, let's avoid the Spin Rooney here. Of course, we are dealing with Ice Physics, as you can see. Very fun. Pretty enjoy- like, pretty much what I would say, um, basically universally stated. The most fun gimmick in pretty much any game is Ice Physics, so. But as you can see, we can't do much that way, so we're going to be going north instead. And I think I can probably dispatch these boys with just my sword. But yes, very excited for um, you know this episode obviously being on a Sunday. I'm recording this on a Saturday. So you'll be seeing this tomorrow. And uh, then the 4th of July is two days later. So very exciting, very fun. 
It's a good holiday to spend time with the old family. Let's do a bomb here. Whoop. Classic trick. All right. Let's see if we can blow this floor up. We can. I do not know much about this dungeon. This is one of the few ones that I don't... Oh. That I don't remember very much. Is this like the guy from Link's Awakening? Master Stalfos? Oh, he is just hopping mad right now. I'm not sure how to dispatch this guy. I've actually never fought him before. I'm shoot you through this. I cannot. I'd like you to come out of there. Oh, there's two of them. All right. Well, let's... uh. Can we hit you with the hame? Whoa. I've got a feeling these guys probably do a ton of damage if they hit you. Yes. There we go. Ooh. Classic. Yeah, this is just like Link's Awakening. I haven't... I have no muscle memory for fighting one of these guys. Oh, that didn't work. Maybe I just need to do the hammer over again. Hammer time. I don't know if that's the only thing that, do that does it. Uh... I think it, I feel like it's got to be, I feel like it's got to be a bomb. That's how, that's how the rules work. But maybe I have to do the bomb actually in good time. I feel like you probably don't need to use the hammer here. You probably could just use um, like a sword or something, but. Okay, apparently that's not working. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm getting a little alarmed here because I feel like that's probably like. I don't need the net. Maybe it's just got to be like a one-two punch. I think I put two bombs there. Oh, no, that worked. All right. I was like, wait a second. Am I doing the, am I doing the game wrong? All right. So unfortunately, we did not get all of our bombs back. What does this say? I didn't even look at this, did I? Okay. Well, I guess that's a little bit of a hint. But if you played Link's Awakening, you'd be a veteran. Just like me course I haven't um, I'm not gonna lie and say that I've played and beaten all the Zeldas because I have not that would be very inaccurate I haven't I feel like I've only beaten off um, only like a handful of them to be honest I I, I want to say the original one Zelda just then um, did I miss something Oh, I got to kill this guy. Wait a second. Almost forgot about you. Um, so the original, oh, there it is. And I said, there's probably just key in here. Um, Zelda Just, the original one. And then um, Breath of the Wild. And, ooh, this looks tricky. What is this? Mario? With your flame ropes. All right, I got to hit that one like that. And um, Link's Awakening, of course, both varieties. So... Yeah, my track record's not great, to be completely honest. I feel like part of it um, is I, I definitely didn't grow up with 3D Zeldas. I had a... Um, I had... The Ocarina of Time, whatever you want to call that. You got it with your GameCube? I think it might have come with Double Dash. I bought... It's like the the GameCube port of Ocarina of Time, which is fine. I mean, not a great version of the game, but, you know, it suffices. It was probably the first time that it had been ported in a while, so. It, it, oh, oh, don't like that. Excuse you. Well, this is not fun. Um, Let's go this way. All right, some stairs, very promising. Into the icy depths, as you could see, we do. A, I think that that's what it was saying, is that we have to go, yeah, we're going way down into this one. Kind of coincidentally, I've been, I don't know if it's like I watched one video and then YouTube's like, you should watch all of these videos. But um, I saw a video that was recently made, or I mean, it wasn't recently made, but I saw it recently, was of people getting trapped in caves like, pretty horrifically, if I'm being completely honest. And, um... You know, after that, YouTube was like, you know, maybe he's interested in seeing all of these. Um, 
Maybe he'll want to... He'll, he'll want to watch every single one of a person being trapped. Oops. I want to see if I can blow up any of these floors. I don't think I can, but we'll try it. We can put more than one bomb at a time in there. Okay, I'm assuming that this is probably... Or maybe I... Well... Does it matter if I go in that one or this one? This was already here. Maybe this means something. Ooh, viewers. Um, well, I don't have the big key, so I guess I can't really do anything with that yet. Or this. Super cool. Thank you, game, for sending me into the pit of despair. Nothing here of measure that I can really do anything with. I don't... Oh, there's a lot going on here. Oh, there's a small key. Some hearts. Very nice. But yeah, I, I saw that video. Just one. Just one. And now uh, YouTube thinks I'm apparently like obsessed with watching videos of people horrifically get trapped to their deaths in caves. I'm not. But it did make me a little sad for them. And we're kind of trapped in a cave right now in the Ice Palace. I can't imagine I would particularly enjoy being in a place like this. Although, viewers, I will say, I'm gonna stand on the door over here for a second. Um, I will say that I do, um, I do prefer being colder rather than hotter. So that's kind of my MO. It's easier for me to warm up than it is to cool down, I would say. And it's the summer months, of course, for those of us here in the Northern Hemisphere. So we do have to deal with a little bit of the heat. Although I'm kind of nervous to say this because I don't want to jinx it, but it has been a relatively mild summer. Oh boy, this looks like danger. This is why I hate ice boots. It's been a relatively mild summer so far and you know, in years past, you can never tell what you're going to get, especially in the area that I live. It can be kind of a crapshoot. Oh, boy. Woo. Made it. Yeah, these ice physics are not fun. I've seen those randomizers that people do where um, you can do the uh, crowd control and people will just put in. Oh, that was dumb. People can put in ice physics as one of the options. That's just cruel. All right, what's this? Another small key. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Okay, up we go. Oh, that's an enemy. I don't want to touch it. That's for the bat. No, that's not the bat. I said rabbit. <laughs> not bat, rabbit. Rabat. All right, let's go ahead and bombos our way. We're actually kind of running a little low on magic, so hopefully there's a big, big thing of pod in here. Or not. Super cool. Oh, there's a little one. We'll take that. But yeah. Um, so being trapped in here kind of sucks. This is not... You know. It's not a dungeon that I have really any muscle memory for. I don't know a lot about it. But I do know that ice physics, ice physics are pretty universally panned as something that people don't enjoy. Do not use all your magic power if you do not pat possess the medicine of magic. Okay. I'm trying not to. Getting that half. Um... Oh, I don't want to touch that. I don't want to touch you. Ooh, there we go. Nice. Nice. Okay. Now I feel like I can probably use my hook shot. Hooking it up. All right. More magic would have been cool, but obviously not. Oh, no. Well... I think that the hitbox is like here-ish. Yeah, boy. Wait, what's down here? Oh, that's just a... Another one of you frozen goobers. Yes, and I think I have another key, so we're on the right track. That doesn't actually... Having another key does not mean that at all. There's stairs here too, so I don't know. I don't know which way to go. There's a... Ooh, that's how you get back. That's a nice little touch. Another key, so we have two of those now. Well, we are trapped over here now. So actually, technically, wait. Can't we do the... Um, I want to say that 
we can use the um we can use the magic whatever the yeah there you go okay can we do that nope that's the map magic cape go okay gotta make sure you turn that off really fast though you don't want to waste your magics all right so we got to remember just all the um none of them these jerks we gotta remember all the tools of the trade here. Hopefully this works. For some reason it wasn't giving me the response earlier when I was trying to fight those guys. Oh yes, viewers, here it is. Just quiet time. Oh yeah. I don't want to turn to a rabbit though. Get away from me. Oh, I didn't know those go away. Alright, quiet time. Oh yeah. Mmm, viewers. Whoa! He got kind of caught in the hitbox of that skull. That was weird. Oh, you know, you know what? Actually, you know, it said sword will do. So I don't know how, like, what the hitbox is for the Stalfos is, but well, that can be four. I'm not sure I've ever seen that. A lot of bombs, though. Save the bombs for your moms. In the map. All right. Does this change the way that the dungeon looks at all? Yeah. Kind of sounded like a uh, home improvement. <laughs> All right, I've got a feeling that this is probably a tongue puzzle. Uh, is this another tongue puzzle? Okay, so that's just... Uh, if you want to get down there... Wait, these are up, not down. I'm dumb. All right, so this is the room we couldn't get into earlier because it was from the other side. Oh, yeah, that's the big key. All right, let's go back. Let's go back to that spot with the... With the magic capes. But we shouldn't need to use that this time because the chest, yes, is on the other side. The chest, yes. All right, ooh. Can I grab that? No. It'd be a little redundant to use the magic cape just to get a little pot of magic, but maybe. Wait. Oh, I can use the hook shot. That was smart. Totally planned, viewers. Absolutely knew exactly what I was doing. Oh yeah, I'm incredible. All right. Let's uh, let's go quickly across this room. And if we remember going down this staircase. Oh, don't touch me. Ugh. Gosh dang planners, cheese balls. I feel like I can't eat those very much. Like when I was a kid, I could just sit at home. And I mean, this is probably like ubiquitous with just childhood. I could just sit at home like a gooby goob and just eat cheese balls all day. I mean, it wasn't one of my favorite snacks. It wasn't even like top five. If we're being completely honest, wasn't even top five. But I could just eat those in perpetuity. Oh, you know what? I think I screwed this up. Now, viewers, what have I done? Is that the boss right there? I don't know what that door opens up, but I'm going to wait. Because I feel like it's probably a super good item and I want it. Oh, no. What did we do here? We want... Oh, no. Things are going poorly. I actually do have recovery items. I went and I purchased them off screen. That's why I have less dollars than I did before. But at this point, I'm in like the top one percent of earners so i don't need any more dollars money means nothing to me you're all welcome to join me on my super yacht if you also have a super yacht that's the only uh the only real way that i'll let you do it conspicuous consumption is kind of important and if you can't flex with me then just don't even bother all right so let's get back to where we were i feel like these things no i don't want to waste magic i've got a feeling i'm going to need it and now I have to go all the way around because I'm stupid. I have to use this again, oh boy. Well, speaking of not using magic, but maybe these weird little penguin things will turn into do. a magic drop. We'll find out. Probably not. Nah. Why would they? That's fun. Um, yeah, I gotta watch out for the flame ropes. Those are causing me problems. So many problems. I got 99 problems and one of those is... Oh, I Stop touching me. All right. So 
viewers. This is not a secret, obviously, because I've already just said it. But I do have, um, I do have healing items, so. When the time comes, whoop, whoop. I don't want to touch these things. I will be using them. Be nice if I didn't have to. Oh no, all right, well, here it is. I went ahead and I bought um, two red potions, so. That will 100% fill up my hearts. And then as you saw, if you were looking, I have two furries as well. You can bring your furries to the furry convention. Stop. Please be magic. Any... What do you... I don't know why I'm afraid of that. I have... All of my, my weapon loadout right now is, is long distance, but I'm like, don't touch me, please. All right. I gotta go... Oh, my gosh. Stop it. Stop. You know what? Let's have a positive moment here for a second, viewers. Um... What's your favorite when it comes to like a, like a holiday? You know, what's your favorite holiday, viewers? Do you enjoy the 4th of July? And this is obviously dependent on where you're from. I know some of my viewers are not from the US and day, which is perfectly fine. What's your favorite national holiday or international holiday, whatever you're into? Religious holiday, whatever floats your boat, melts your butter. 4th of July, pretty darn good. It's Kind of hard not to enjoy it. It breaks up the, um, it breaks up the monotony of summer a little bit. And I mean, like, D Mike, how can you say that? How can you say that there's monotony in summer? Um, well, you know, oh boy. These things do a ton of damage. Oh, I just wasted one of my fairies. I wasn't expecting that. And I don't have any, I don't think I have any more magic either. This is bad. Let's go down here. I think we can get the item now. Yes, what, what do you think it is, viewers? We're in a dark, cold, icy place. What better way to cheer us up than blue mail? Okay, actually, that probably would have been nice to have because you've seen me play and I am reckless as heck. So when you're wreck as heck, you're going to need to uh, stop. I don't know of any other way to take those guys out. I do need some magic drops, though. I basically have to just kind of... Whoa! Wasn't expecting that. Can any of you drop magics? Or even just the Stalfos. Like, if you want to drop some magic, that'd be dope. All right, we're doing this the old-fashioned way. And I have two keys, which is a lot of keys. Um, trying to wait for all of you to calm down here. You're getting a little spicy for me. Really? None of you? Wow. Viewers, you know what we call that? We call that super not cool. Whoa, don't touch me. Um. Can we pick these up? What does anything do? Uh, okay. Oh, I hate these things. Can we kill these frozen things with... No. Oh, this is... This is danger. No, I don't want to burn through my other key. Oh, I'm just dropping bombs. I'm not even meaning to. No, I didn't, I didn't mean burn through my other key. I'm being stupid. Let's go through here to safety. All right. Is this a safe room or is this game just messing? Oh, boy. Can you just go away? All right. You know what? Okay. Let's just take a minute. And, let's just take a minute and decompress. Okay. Can there be... Okay. So two and a half hearts is not enough to stop the bing bongs. That's not a lot of magic. Can I come back and do it again? Will it respawn? Viewers, it will probably not respawn. Well, we can hope, right? You stay away from me. Whee! But it is... I mean, I have the blue mail and I don't really feel like that honestly improved my situation. In the slightest, yeah, this is probably not anything. Ooh, I should have brought a green potion, or what's the one that gives you a little bit of both? I think it's like, uh... Uh, it's like health and, health and magics. All right, um... So we lowered those bricks. And there was the stuff on the... Yeah, I wonder if there's anything down there. Maybe like a, 
I mean, there's there's got to be a reason for this, right? Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Stop it. Stop hitting yourself. All right. Um, Let's go down here. I'm just going to hope for the best. Okay. Oh, yes. Viewers. We're saved. All right, how many spaces do we have? Two? Two fairies and a red potion should be pretty good. Oh, I need to capture you. Come here. Yes, I would much rather prob- Oh, well. How many is that then? I mean, two is pretty good. That's two. That's two get out of jail for free cards. I'm actually curious if I can do that again. Probably not. I would really love, because now that I'm full, full energy, Yes, I can farm a little bit of magic. I've got a feeling that, given how much I've had to use the fire rod in this stupid dungeon, that it's probably going to request more of me. MORE MAGICS! Alright, I don't know what happens if you get on this side. Oh, they're back! Okay, cool. Actually, um... I don't feel bad about this, because... I'm very bad at this game. And I just want to have a good time. Viewers, I'm just trying to have a fun cash time so maybe get off my back all right it's fine all right so we're gonna ignore the stalfos and i think we can do this well maybe hold on we need you to go away all right let's go ahead and break that up yes viewers okay i believe this is the shortcut that i was referring to um I think that if you don't have the Cane of Samaria, if you do this in the other order, that you can't go this way. This is a bit of a shortcut, I think. Oops. Was not looking at the screen when this happened. Yeah, it looks like the, um, oh gosh. the blue mail is paying off already, though. Does anybody love to get mail? Does anybody remember how, when you're a kid, maybe this is just me, whenever I tell these stories, um, I'm always, I always sound kind of dumb. But um, when I tell these stories, I'm like, oh, does anybody remember this or that? Um, oh, more magic. Yes. Can I pull this? Is there a reason? Maybe this isn't a shortcut and I'm just stupid. Um, yeah, but I remember like getting mail as a kid was like a big deal for some reason. I was like, oh, yeah. Wish I could get some mail. Okay, I think this is actually the boss. Well, that's nice. It is a shortcut. I lied. I lied. No, I was honest. And then I was confused. And then I was honest again. Okay, so I think we need to melt this boy. It's like trying to un... I almost said unthaw. Oh my gosh, my Midwest is leaking. Um, is this working? Uh, just trying not to have you hit me. Okay, that worked. Whoa! Alright, I'm just going to rely on the... Uh, Tried and true, spin attack. Stay away from me. It's kind of look like Krakow from, uh, from Kirby. Oh boy. Yeah, these guys are packing a punch. Nope. Don't you do it. I like how their eyes actually do kind of follow you around the room a little bit. Ooh, that's one. Ooh. Game is like, please stop at the frame rate. This is a supercharged copy of this game. It should not be having any trouble. All right, that's two. All right. Oh, viewers, we've done it. Okay. Okay. That didn't feel too bad, did it? Yeah, we have uh, only two more hearts left, and we've got the complete loadout of the game. Wow. Okay. Wow. I believe that thing was called Cold Stare, which is a very funny name. Hmm. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, I might have cheesed that a little bit. I don't know. We have gotten another Maiden. Very good. We only have one more dungeon left to go before the finale. We've got a little bit of, um... A little bit of overworld stuff to do, obviously, because we still have one more heart to gain from a... From a full heart piece, we only have... We need two more heart pieces. Great. Should probably be paying attention to this, but I'm not. Oh, thanks. You believe in us. Yes, we do. 
Validation goes a long way, viewers. Make sure you tell people you love them. All right, here we go. Full magic, full hearts, blue mail. Let's go ahead and kill this guy so I can do my outro. Oh, <laughs> of course that would happen anyway. All right. So thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sundays with more A Link to the Past, and I will see you next time. Bye.